Do you or do you not think that the National Security Agency, the NSA, is still conducting warrantless, which is to say illegal wiretaps, on American citizens? Well, the the problem is that Congress, after our stories, and uh, the Congress changed the law to make what they were doing legal. Uh, that, <laughs> that was the sad part about all this, is after our stories revealed the existence of this domestic spying program, in 2008, Congress passed what's called the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act uh, Amendments Act, which meant that they changed the law that they had been violating and uh, more or less allowed the Bush administration to do what they had been doing but now called it legal. I remember people at the time said, it's as if you got caught uh, speeding and then the state legislature changed the law and raised the speed limit because they didn't want you to have to get a ticket. Or you know, they or you robbed a bank and they said, okay, well, we'll just say it's legal to rob banks. That's essentially what happened. And then after Edward Snowden's uh, revelations, which you know basically provided much more detail on the program than we had and showed <clears throat> showed that it had expanded under uh, Obama from where we had been writing about it. Congress passed more laws, basically still saying, you know, they limited it a little bit, but still basically uh, said it's okay to keep doing it. And Congress now is about to reauthorize uh, the legislation that legalizes all this. So it's uh, that that was a, to me uh, showed the power of the war on terror, which is that Americans are willing for the most part, to give up civil liberties in exchange for what somebody convinces them is security.